Hey everyone, this is Sean. Today's video is designed for those of you who are new to armed security. Today we are going to be talking about holsters. Other than the personal responsibility you have of choosing the right duty gun, comes the responsibility of choosing the right duty holster. You are going to easily spend somewhere between $170 to $220 on the proper holster. If right now you're saying that's too much, I don't have enough money for the proper holster, then please wait. Don't get into armed private security yet. Wait until you have that money and then, and then only until then, get into it. You have to have the right holster. If you get some cheap, cheap brand holster, some holster that has not been combat tested either in the military or law enforcement, you're cutting possibly your life short. Okay, that person can easily break the gun away from the holster and use it against you. I trust Safari Land with my life. I've carried Safari Land holsters for more than 23 years. This is a 6360 RDS. RDS stands for Red Dot System. What I love about Safari Land is the is the QLS fork system. So QLS stands for quick locking system. And I'll show you what that refers to. So this is the receiving end of the QLS system. You're gonna hear that lock in a minute. See that lock? Or you hear that lock? Locks in place. The amazing thing about this system is that I can get this holster I'm gonna go off camera a little bit so I can take this attachment out I can get this holster as long as I have the fork attachment and I can attach this holster to any duty belt or any carrier that has this attachment to it. It's pretty neat. And you might be wondering, well, Sean, what do I need this for? Well, what I use it for is for training. I have a duty belt set up and then I have a training belt set up. Now, ideally you want everything on your duty belt to be on your training belt as, as well. 